morning, everybody. Did you sleep there all night, Bunny? Or did you push Wilfie out of the bed? Hello. Wakey, wakey. Ladies and gents, today's school run was absolutely just beautiful. Oh, crunchy grass. Hello, ladies. Are you ready for your corn? Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, let's give you some food. Look at all of this lovely frost. Let's give you some more food. I've had a question pop up about this room that we're about to walk into. It's just off from the kitchen. I thought you were using your... Um, I'm not podcasting, I'm your, vlogging. It's the same thing, isn't it? No. Aren't you using if your... you don't know that by now, Toby, you using... then you're no good at your job. <laughs> aren't, you... aren't you using that silly thing you bought? Not when I'm vlogging. Okay. I'm not going to walk around with a tripod <coughs> with a ring light on it. You're making me choke. Go away. Where are you filming? I'm just... Put your bugger off. What are you filming? Not this room. Why? Because someone wants to know why the fireplace is in the window. Where else would you put it? Well, that's what I'm about to explain. Oh. <laughs> Fuck off. Why don't you light it and show them how it works? I did that yesterday. <laughs> no, I didn't light it to show them how it works. I just filmed lighting it yesterday. Oh, look, he's bored. He's walked off. Right. <laughs> that's the answer. <laughs> Where else would it go? Oh, I'm wheezing because I ran most of the dog walk. Because it was blinking cold. So, can you hear him? He's laughing to himself. Legally, you have to be a certain distance away from a wall. And you have to have a fireproof base that comes out a certain distance, depending on, I think, the swing of the door, something like that. And because this room is relatively narrow and Toby had his heart set on this sofa... The only place we could put the fire was where the recess of the window is. So the window is recessed about that much. Well, you can see, can't you? So it went there because if we put it in that corner, the sofa couldn't go there. And we tried every which way to make, to see how we could have the configuration of the sofa and you just couldn't really do it because it's too long to go across the back wall. And if it went across the back wall, then the majority of the people would be trying, would be facing this way and you couldn't put the telly over there. So that's, that's the reason. Um, we didn't put it there because the radiator was already there didn't put it in that corner because of the same reason but cool it's a big cobweb up there but it doesn't matter light wise because we have the light up there the window I mean and a big window there ah, so um, it works really well the layout for us as a family my only complaint about this fire is that sometimes it just gets way too hot, but we've worked out if you use smaller logs, that's not a problem. And if you're wondering, why am I? Why do I have apples hanging up here? It's because it's little Timmy's, our hamster's favourite treat. So I dry him uh, apple pieces. Ooh. Let's go and give him a bit of this one. Baby! Baby! Hello, baby. Come on 
out, sweetheart. Here he comes. Hello, darling. Oh, yawning. Oh, you precious boy. I should have put a light on. It's a bit dark. What's this then? Is that yummy? Sorry, it's so blurry. It's dark and it's struggling to focus. Oh, isn't he lovely? A lovely boy. Right, I have to go on the school run. I'll cuddle you later, darling. I just saw a woman with fair old leg warmers and now I want some. Oh, they look so good. Sorry about the funny angle here, but I'm in the school car park and it is chock-a-block. And there's people around. Oh, I feel like I all wheezy. It's because I was running. I didn't have much time to walk the dog and I wanted to give her a full walk. So we ran most of it and it's cold and I'm not used to running at the moment. So I got a bit wheezy. It's all right, you know, nothing to worry about. I just get a wet lung when I go from hot to cold or exert myself. Today, I've hardly picked up my camera. I did the school run, got back, had some breakfast, sorted out the dogs, went to pottery, had such a lovely time as usual. It was all Christmassy and just, oh, the wood burner was on. My friends are just the loveliest people. And I had a great time. And then I went to um, a town, a seaside town called Clevedon, just up the road, and I called in and picked up some yarn. Alice from Wool Matters, she had some of my walnuts, um, my walnut husk thingies, over over the summer. I sent some to Karen and I sent some to Alice because I I I promised them around, but most of the squirrels ran off with most of them, and. Um, so she dyed up some skeins with walnut and madder and reserved three for me. So I went to pick those up. They are absolutely lovely. I know I'm not supposed to be getting wool, but I just can't say no. Oh, it's gorgeous though. I'll show you it. It's um, British Merino. It's ethically reared, super soft. It's absolutely lovely. Uh, non superwash in a walnutty colour. I think I might make a tulip jumper. Um, what else can I tell you? Then I came back and Toby was back. He was having a cheese sandwich and um, I quickly put some soup on to defrost. And then I ran the dog and then. I came back, I filmed that little bit, oh that's my um, dash cam, I, oh I'm going to have to move, hang on I've got to move. Well I've just had some excellent news, my stepmum has just been given the all clear today, She's um, she's had cancer and now she hasn't got it anymore so that's absolutely brilliant. Um, Dad I know you watch this. Stop crying. <laughs> yeah, it's great news. Bloody brilliant news. I am making the pastry for tonight's supper. We are going to add it to his leeks. I've got some leftover chicken. I'm going to make a white sauce. I'm going to chuck in some mushrooms. Oh, it's going to be lovely. We'll have it with peas and broccoli. So this is Rachel from So Ray Me's recipe. She does pastry two to one ratio. So if I've got 300 grams of flour, I will add 150 grams of fat. And I will use half butter and half lard. There we go. And now I will cut this in with my Kurtner if air. If Ted ever watches this. He'll laugh at that. Um, and then I'll do the breadcrumb thing with my fingertips. My hands are 
a fun card, so making pastry isn't too bad for me. My mother-in-law's hands are always boiling hot, so she melts the butter and makes rubbish pastry by hand. She makes beautiful pastry in a magic mix, because she is a beautiful cook. There we go. I've mixed it all in with my fingertips. Now I'm going to pour in icy cold water until it comes together. I'll go and get my tripod if you're interested. You can watch this and if you're not, you can skip forward. Here we go. Icy cold water. Splosh a bit in. Like they say, stir with a knife, trouble and strife. So I tried to cut it in rather than stirring it. Oh, stirred it. They say the trick to pastry is don't handle it too much. A light hand is best, is what they say. Who knows how this is going to turn out because I've used a mixture of spout flour, so it needs using up, and spout, ema, and einkorn. Let's see how it goes. Don't tell Toby. He just likes the regular stuff. I'm nearly there, but you can see it's beginning to hold. a bit dry still. Let me just sprinkle on a bit more. You know me, I'm not a textbook cook, experimental and budget. Just pressing it together, I'm not actually kneading it. I know it looks like that, but I promise you I'm not. Of course, this is different flour to what I'm used to. It's bound to absorb the water differently. I'm going to put it back in the bowl and put it in the fridge and it can do a bit of resting. Not that I I don't know whether iron corn, ema, spelt needs that. Let's flatten it out a bit just so that it all cools down. My phone's about to die. Let's see how this pastry is doing. It feels a bit dry. I think it'll be all right. Let's get a, a little, that was noisy. That's a chip, not dirt. I don't know if it's safe, food safe or not. Well, I'll let you know tomorrow if I'm dead. Need a bit more. There's always an Ikea bag full of washing. I moved that earlier because of the, where the camera was shooting. And now I'm going from this direction, you can see it. That's about as much editing as you'll get from this place. Because I don't, I don't filter anything. Oh, am I gonna need a, I think I'm gonna need, oh, this looks awful. I think I'm going to need some dust. I don't normally need extra flour to roll it out with regular pastry. Oh no, it's looking okay now. Just a bit mottled. I've made a lot. I've made way too much. I want it thin. Oh, I haven't put the oven on. Oh, bonkers. My excuse is I opened up a bottle of wine when I got the great, brilliant news about my stepmom having the all clear. And well, I've had two glasses and now I'm pretty hammered. <laughs> It's not going to stop me having a third glass though, I can tell you. I'm in absolute denial about the fact that we're going away soon. Whoops, I'm not ready. 
My mum's coming tomorrow. We're going out, so I won't be able to get ready tomorrow. Um, and uh, Bill's college has sprung um, a Christmas event on us. They gave us a letter. Well, who knows how long it's been in Bill's bag for, to be honest. No, what's the date on it? Tuesday. They gave us the letter on Tuesday saying that there's an event on Friday afternoon. Well, I have, I have planned my week and that weren't on my plan. It is now though. Of course, I'm not going to miss that, am I? Just means that I'll have to stay up late tomorrow probably and a bit tonight. I make wonderful tasty pies but they're always very ugly. I don't uh, blind bake my pastry. I just heat up the oven to quite hot. Make sure that there's a baking tray in there. Let's put one in because that other one's got a bit of pizza left on it. So I'm a very good housewife. That's tongue in cheek, just in case you didn't know. Right, let's dollop in this. Uh, it's not called stuffing, what do you call it? Filling. Mushrooms, leeks, white sauce, all flavoured up with lots of lovely deliciousness. Chicken. Yummers. Right, now we need to wet the edges to stick this on. All I do is I wet my hands. <laughs> Honestly, cooking with gainer. I make lovely tasting food, but it always looks rubbish. Look at that, rubbish. I seamed that together, as you can see. Give it a pinch. Proper bloggers would do some fancy stuff, but I don't. I just gather it all up and hope for the best. Who's got time? In real life, unless your job is vlogging, we don't have time, do we ladies? We've got stuff to do, things to knit. Oh, I ought to get a bit of milk over the top just to make it golden. I don't have time. I do have time. I don't want to wash up the brush. Let's just smear some milk on. Oh, it's lovely. Oh, you can't go wrong with a bit of milk. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Let's just uh, roll it around. Shove it in the oven. Which needs a clean before I go away because my friends, oh, I've said so many times, my friends are coming to look after the house and they, I am here, they both like to cook. So it'd be really nice if I could leave them with a clean oven that they can then mess up to their heart's desire. Da. Oh, for God's sake, I'm trying <laughs> a bloody vlog. Do you want to do your little tea? Children's TV presenter noise. No, I'm not doing that. You're not going to do it? You're not going to do it for the vlog? No. Shall okay. I do it? Hurry up, I'm hungry. <laughs> I just punched you in the head. Yeah. Oh, pastry. Yeah. I can't, can you? Oh, I know what you mean. English mustard. English, English mustard. Toby. <laughs> I want to demonstrate how crispy the pastry is, but I can't do it with one hand. Can you come and what do you want me to do? just take the knife and cut it? Cut it where? Well, well, dead along there. <laughs> Sounds nice, don't it? What are you going to get it out with? You're never going to get it out with that. No, probably not. What was that? 
No, probably not. I'll probably not. Right. I'll do it with this game now. What's that then, Toby? It's like a spatula thing. A spat spatula. It's not working, Gaina. Uh oh. What's the bottom like? Is it? Do we what? have a? Have we got a shoggy bottom? I don't think there is a bottom. There is a bottom. Oh, Margo. Um. Flip that upside down. What that? Um, yeah, the whole that whole piece there. This is a much bigger pie than I realised. Right. Bloody hell! It's not okay. going. <gasps> don't soggy? touch it. Come on, give it a light. I can't believe you. Video it, it does look a mess. <gasps> oh, it's Come on, wait, I'm hungry. wait a minute, I had an alert. What are you doing? You flipped it over again. Oh, I've had an alert and I've had an alarm. No soggy bottom. Now you can eat it. Oh, I've had too much to drink. Pretty drunk. Look. <laughs> I'm celebrating. I have no idea why I'm recording that. I don't know. And you're right in the way. Just I'm, I'm sorry. Just don't. Oi, stop manhandling well, me. I'm doing mine. You can see Oi, yourself you're out. Very brutal. Don't eat oh, the broccoli stalks. Why would I eat the broccoli stalks? Well, they're for the dog. I don't know. You're a very greedy person. <laughs> Disgusting. I bet you they're lovely. Margot wants to be let out. She's gr grungling. Don't want to go up, Margot. Gravy, nice. Oh look, there's my uh, thick midriff. We're doing drunk DIY. I'm not drunk. <laughs> I am. Hey, Come on. Hey, it's a good idea doing it now. Oh yeah. Oh, brilliant idea. I believe it's Wednesday night. It's a brilliant idea. Come on. That's the whole reason why we've got Wilf because of all of my brilliant ideas. Ooh. Straight. What? No, be. You, Where do you want it? Straightness is not a problem. Right, I need to stand here, get get up, get up on the bed, and I'll tell you when my head. Now, if this is safe, this bed. is. Of course, it's safe. You put it. Together. <laughs> I know. Because well, you tightened up the screws. I know one of them is completely missing. broken. Oh, there's a problem. Oh, what's up? It's just my phone doing a thing. It's quite heavy. Right, look, that's way too high. Come down. Lower, 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 lower. Lower, 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 lower. Lower, 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 lower. Stop. That will obviously I'll hang it correctly. Well, hurry up, because it's freaking heavy. I know, my granddad got that. From a second Put it down. Toby has deserted me. I've put this shelf up <laughs> <laughs> I put this shelf up earlier and I put it where I felt it was right in accordance with the bed if only I'd realised it was have you only... put it in the wrong place no it's perfect for the bed but it's just off centre oh god you can't leave it like that it. it's awful it's fine it's, it's not fun. no because when the door's open which most of the time it is yeah, and when you're it's lying, still, it is, still isn't. When you're lying in the bed, you can put your glass of water on there. You've messed that up, mate. That is awful. This is what I have to do when I'm all by myself, because you don't help me. I don't have a wing, man. I'm all by myself. <gasps> you can put anything on that. Oh, no. What's happened to it? It's coming out of the plugs, mate. <gasps> what have you just done? Okay, no. I can't believe... Oh, Toby, I can't It's very difficult to fix into. Why did you do that? You know, I, it, mate, that is just terrible. Absolutely terrible. <laughs> do you want me to do it properly? I'm doing. I'm not. I'm not doing it now. I mean, it's not even straight. To what the, would you have done? To the radiator. What would you have done differently to me? Have you just gone straight into though that the wall with that without any? That that's what they're supposed to do. This isn't drive board, this isn't plasterboard. Yes, it is. I don't think it is, mate. What is it then? That bit. Have I done that one all right? 
We'll Does that feel secure? Put, shove that up then. There's a nice little hook. Yeah, there's gonna be a massive great big hole in the wall, isn't it? <laughs> Bill's gonna be in there raging. What is that? Oh, that's gonna be fine. Oh, it looks awful on camera. It looks really stark. It looks like someone's been snorting coke off it. What? Look. Only, yeah, you know, only, such a mess. only you would think that with your misspent youth. The little bastard. Back to the drawing board with that. At least I've got a tension rod up there to wrap some beautifulness around. And there's a mirror and it's, it's all going to be okay, everybody. It's going to be okay.